Hey, hey, what's going on, y'all? This is Davis, and today we're going to be looking at a 36-inch Sony Trintron TV. Let's get into it. So this is it, my 36 inch Sony Trintron CRT TV. We're gonna start this off, this little overview off, with a little bit of a story. So this TV here, if you look in the spec sheet, weighs exactly, well not, good, not I'm not gonna say exactly, but weighs somewhere in the neighborhood of 220 pounds. As you can imagine, I live on the second floor of an apartment building. It was a little bit difficult getting it up here. So what I do? I bought a I bought a freaking um, a dolly. Yeah, I bought a dolly, right? <clears throat> Use the dolly and a couple of straps. Strap that baby on the dolly. Roll her up the stairs one stair at a time with uh, the help of one of my neighbors and um, and my girlfriend. It was uh, it was a little bit of a trip, but nonetheless, I'm extremely happy. With, uh, with this CRT, so I'm super glad that I actually did bring it up, bring it up here because, good lord, I didn't, I didn't really realize how good component video can look uh, until I got it on CRT. I, I'm extremely impressed. I had a, um, a little HD converter. Uh, it converted a uh, component to an HD signal with uh, HDMI out so that I could use it on my TV, right, my older consoles. Um, and it just looked like garbage. And I just thought that's what component looked like. I never had any better, uh, any better understanding. So I just went with it. Uh, but like I said, this TV's proven me wrong. It's not the signal, it's how it's being processed. Right now you're looking at uh, The Legend of Zelda, uh, A Link to the Past. I forgot for a second there, I had to look at the cartridge. Uh, but um, I've been playing the cra a crap ton out of that uh, out of that game on this TV, and uh, I've been extremely impressed. Uh, as to, well, obviously I've been playing it, so I must not, have, I must be enjoying it at least a little bit. But like, it's just, it's unbelievable to me that uh, that these colors are so, I don't know, they just seem so, so perfect. And maybe I, I, I kind of sound like I'm uh, getting a little bit uh, fanboyish here, but. Um, I'm truly impressed with the uh, with the video quality. And I can even give you a little bit of a sound quality test here. Like it doesn't sound fantastic, but it's not bad. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show your own back. All right, so I pulled this sucker back a little bit. First thing I'll show you, uh, in case you didn't believe me, there's the model number, model information. Got the nice big Sony logo back here. Along with two component inputs and a composite input, which that composite input, I haven't gotten the opportunity to try yet because I don't have anything in composite. I need to get the uh, uh, a set of composite PS2 cables so I can try it. Super excited to see what that looks like. Um, also got audio out, uh, so I'm planning. On, I'm kind of planning on hooking up my. Uh, I have a couple of bookshelf speakers. See how that sounds in there. Along with your standard TV line in. Uh, right now I've got that plugged into an Atari 2600, which does not work. I've been working on that a little bit in my spare time, but haven't quite gotten it fixed up yet. But, uh, but yeah, anyway, that's, uh, that's a quick look around. I think uh, next video I got the queue up here, next clip is, uh, is a video demonstration. Uh, I've got uh, a few different consoles, a few different games I show, I, I uh, plug in, play for about you know, 20, 30 seconds. I don't know, it gives a pr pretty good demonstration of what you can expect out of something like this. See it, see it a bit.